Smoking that Marlins pack, baby. How's it going, Mets fans? We are on location. I'm out of town, enjoying my weekend on the beach, but that isn't stopping me from talking about another Mets dub. Here they beat the Marlins in game one of a three-game set, 5-3 to three over Miami. Winning 5-3 to three is your final. You see Taiwan Walker going six, having three earned. No problem. Five strikeouts. And the story of the day, folks, and this is a cigar in case you're wondering. I'm not doing anything crazy here. Yes, Francisco Lindor, Mr. Smile himself. What does he do? He hits a solo bomb there in the first. And even though the Mets can surrender that run in the second half there in the first, then we get to the sixth. We got bases juiced, right? And then Francisco Lindor comes up. What does he do? He clears the bases absolutely with a bases clearing double to give the Mets ultimately the 5-3 lead, the 5-3 victory. Mark Canna hits a solo bomb in this one because, of course, he does. Can of corn, baby. You'll love to see that. So the Mets are now back to 20 games above 500. They start things off on a great impression against Sandy Alcantara, arguably the best pitcher, not just in all the NL, but in all baseball. We take that to the bank every single day of the week. Mets look for the series victory tomorrow. That's going to be a fun one with Chris Bassett. Sea Bass on the mound, folks. I'm pumped up. Mets in Miami. Feel like I'm in Miami, even though I'm in Delaware right now. We're enjoying the vibes. Let's go, Mets, baby. Make sure to let me know your thoughts in comments below. How do you feel after this Mets victory? Winning 5-3 in this series opener, a three-game set against the Marlins. And, of course, folks, if you found yourself enjoying this Mets content, quick recap again. Normally, I'm live streaming for post-game show, but on location, Wardy, we're going to make it happen regardless. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button, share all that fun stuff, and let's go Mets, baby. I'll talk to you guys again real soon.